Boy, John, you can't beat these Alberta views. No, pretty unbelievable, aren't they? Yeah. John's huge for this business. He was one of the first ones, I think, to bring a Western to Alberta. I would say he's one of the ambassadors of the film industry in Canada. It's a little bit like meeting a movie star. You could probably say his name anywhere in Alberta, and someone will know who he is. Usually when I work on a film, my title role or my job will be that as a wrangler. I coordinate a lot of stunts and works as a stunt coordinator and a stunt man. He has been part of well over 200 or 250 productions, which represents uh, getting close to a billion dollars worth of work. I think that there has been a, a massive impact that John has had on this industry um, and has helped us grow and, and get the, the look and feel of Alberta out to the world. I could see that when they wanted to make Western pictures that Alberta was going to be a great backdrop. You needed big, diverse landscapes like we've got here. The Western way of life and our, our Western heritage is under attack right now. We're, we're having trouble sustaining this. It's not just a job to him. He's got a real passion for the Western lifestyle and the Western culture. I always tried to hire positive people and fun people. It was like, kids that never grew up. We played cowboys and Indians when we were kids. Uh, when we got to be 20, 30, 40 years old, we're still playing cowboys and Indians. 